to Ewan's Buzz. Today we're going to be taking a look at the screen that my uncle gave me. So we're just going to be giving it a clean because it still works and it's a really nice screen. And as you can see, it is a Samsung SyncMaster 500S. And the really nice thing about this screen is that it's got all separate controls, so you're not fumbling around in a menu to try find, well, what control you're looking for. You know, to adjust the brightness or something like that. And now this screen is quite small for CRT screens, which are those big screens that you usually see in old movies and such. And this is really nice. It looks pretty big on camera, but in real life it is a lot smaller than some of the other ones I have. So, let's get right to it and clean it all up. Um, just one thing I do want to let you know, um, I, it is really cold in my workshop so I have got a heater on, so if you hear some background noise it's just that. And yeah, let's get right to it. My stone of mind. Alright, so brief interruption with the cleaning. So I want to show you something pretty cool on these screens. And well, I know you can also do it on modern screens. But now, since these screens do tend to get quite dusty because they make static electricity when they run and the dust sort of sticks to the screen, but not the casing, but the actual tube inside the screen. But over time, they just get dirty. And so, as you can see, this does not swivel very nicely anymore. As you can hear, it's very rough. And this is how you remove this stand. You pull this little clip up here, which should be on most monitors, and then your stand will come off like this. Well, you're also probably wondering how would I clean the actual swivelly part. Well, I will show you now. Okay, so here is the stand that we took off, and now I'm going to show you how to remove the swivelly part here, how to remove it. So, at the bottom of the stand there should be a little, another clip like this, which is this clip right here. And there's also an arrow telling you which way you should turn this top part to get it to come off. So now, what you do is you pull the clip backwards and then you turn this in the direction that it wants you to turn it. And then, these two should, should be like this and then, voila! Your stand separates from the base and the swivelly part that connects to the monitor. So now, you can get a good clean of this round part and the part on the inside. So now, let's clean the stand. through all of these nooks and crannies in the bottom of the stand. The reason why those are all there is so the stand will be strong, because these screens are still quite heavy. So this won't break, that's why all of these are here. So, once we reattach this, it is going to be really nice. But now, before I reattach it, I'm going to show you how to reattach it. So as you can see, here is the base, and here is that little notch that it connects to. And so, I'm going to put this down on the desk, because it's a little bit easier to do it on there. And we are going to take this part and line it up with the notch, so that the notch is sitting like so, as you can see here. And now we're just going to twist it, and you should hear like a kathunk. And then, now, your stand is all reconnected. And now check how nicely this turns and swivels. Almost effortlessly. And now, isn't that nice? So, it is pretty easy to reattach to the monitor, and I'll show you how to do that now. Alright, so now we are looking at the bottom of the monitor where the space goes. And now I'm going to show you how to reattach it. So if you look here, there are all these little notches and little slots for this to slide into the metal bottom of the monitor. And as you can see, there's some right here that those little slots will go into. And so, this is how you do it. You make sure you line up all the little holes and then 
Once they're all lined up, you just press down and you should hear a click. Like that. And there you go. Now your monitor base is clean and reattached. And so, I have turned the monitor around and now it's back up on its stand. And now I really want to show you how worth it is to clean the stand. Look at this. I've got one finger and I can move this monitor so smoothly. And it tilts up and down and left to right. It is amazing what a little clean can do to a monitor stand. And basically all my monitors that I have have been cleaned and they turn so nicely. And that is why it is so worth it to clean your old monitors because you never know what the outcome might be. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I thank you all for watching. Goodbye.